What's up my fellow Pyros? This is Pyro101881 coming at you one last time before the holiday. I wanted to give you guys an update on what I got going on here. Be a real quick video, just go over some of the finale boards I made and the, the grand finale. I got starting up, I got these neon fusion, two blue, two orange. My uh, <laughs> my kid is a big fan of Nerf guns and the Nerf guns are almost the exact same colors of these blue and orange, so I decided I'd make them a nice finale board. I really like these cakes, guys. These have really nice, bright colors, and I put them together. I stringed them all together with a uh, perfect fuse here. I figure by the time this one's reaching its finale, this one should be midway through, so it'll be a decent, a decent lengthy show. I'm hoping to get it over a minute. I'm not sure how that'll work. I know these are about 30 seconds a piece, but we'll see how that goes. So that's that. Over here, I got, and I told you guys I was gonna do this in a previous video. I got Killer Cake here by Winda. Okay, and I got two of these certified black label by Red Apple Fireworks. I really like the contrast of these cakes. This one is all neon, bright neon colors. This one's got a lot of gold and uh, strobe and um, crackle in it. So I wanted to see what would happen if I fused them together. I got them all fused here with uh, fast fuse and then of course the visco safety fuse tied in here so we'll see how that goes this puppy right here this is fire in the hole by Canon and I've got two of them okay so I fused them together and I put them on so you know the fan starts on this one the fan starts over here right so it's gonna go from right to left and on this one back here the fan starts on the left and we'll go left to right. So you should see the fans crisscrossing in the air. And I measured out the, the fuse. It should be the exact same length. You guys all know that that doesn't mean that they will go off at the same time. It just is what it is. Too many variables there. And I didn't want to hook up my firing system to it. I just figured I'd fuse it up. I don't plan on bringing out my firing system until uh, the finale. So I just fused it. Over here, I got... My cat call. You guys know I love this fountain. This is my favorite fountain. It's the only fountain I ever buy. By Brothers. Um, so let me see if I can... Nope. Can't get it any brighter. Sorry, guys. Um, so I got cat call here by Brothers. This has some red and green in it. So I took two of the Neon Fusion red and green cakes and I fused them together. I got it, again, with the perfect fuse. Pink fuse. This this uh, fountain is about a minute long, so by the time the red and blue comes into the show, these cakes should be going off in the background. So I'll see how it looks and I'll record it for you guys. Over here, so this will this will be my grand finale, but I feel like I should explain. So my firing system will be in the middle. I have everything you see here. This G-Force, this purple G-Force cake, and the Angry Pandas, okay? I have two of these fused up with my firing talons and taped together, okay? This G-Force finale set here, which I love. I have two of these taped up, fused together with my electronic firing talons and fast fused together. And these Bombastics, I have four of those. I'm just showing you one of everything. So. Basically, try to imagine that my firing system's in the middle. I'll have this on the left side of the firing system, and then an exact replica of this on the right side of my firing system. So it'll be a smaller, a very small version of Red Apple Fireworks demo finale when they did theirs. So that's the theory. Now, except, so I got this, the G Force, the Bombastics. And then these guys, my three on a rack here, these will all be in the middle. They'll be behind my firing system and they will be in the middle here. You can see I got the firing talons all hooked up and everything, all ready to go. Okay, I got my lead here. So these guys will be in the middle. I'll fire these two first, the, the UVs, and then I'll fire the Triumph last and that'll be in the middle. I'll, I might, I'm kind of on the fence about this, I might incorporate uh, my 20 shot mortar rack into this and I might not. I'm, I'm on the fence about this. My, uh, 
my girlfriend's already flipping out about what I've already shown her. So, uh, that's pretty much it. I'll come over here. You see, I got all my stuff. I got to get it all put away. Again, my girlfriend's going to flip out. So, you know, I got all my miscellaneous stuff down here that's left over that's not on a board. <coughs> I got my gold finale board here. Got the other two bombastics on top of it for the other side of my finale cake. I guess I did actually wire this gold finale board up with my uh, electronic firing system with the talons as well. So that'll actually fire as well. And my, if you guys watched my previous video, you know my, my theory is to go the rolled gold on the outside first. They got a nice mine effect to them. And then the metalist next. Now, I've heard that uh, the metalist is more of a silver than a gold. So we'll see how it goes. I mean, either way, I think it'll look nice because I know the rolled gold have a nice gold color to them. So if I got silver in the middle and gold on the sides, so be it. I won't know until I find out. So, um, but I will find out. So as soon as I get that video done, I'll, I'll post it and record it for you guys. Anyway, let me know what you think, guys. If you got any questions, comments, I'm curious. Um, and I'll come back at you on July 5th, most likely. Peace.